Hi and welcome to the fifth section of this course, a 2D adventure. In this section we'll begin a completely new project, specifically a 2D adventure game in which the player controls an alien character, exploring and navigating a dangerous world complete with quests and interactive elements. This project will incorporate elements and ideas from previous sections as well as focus on new techniques such as complex collisions, 2D physics, singletons and statics and more. This section will demonstrate the following topics. 2D characters and player movement, assembling complex and multi-part characters, level design, 2D physics and collision detection. Now we'll see the first video of section 5, a 2D adventure, getting started. In this video we'll learn to create a 2D adventure. Adventure games require the player to use their cunning, dexterity, mental sharpness and acumen to make progress. Such games feature dangerous obstacles, challenging missions and character interaction, as opposed to all-out action like many first-person shooter games. Our adventure game will be no exception. In this game, the player moves around using the keyboard, the arrows or WASD keys. Furthermore, they can jump with the spacebar and interact with characters simply by approaching them. During the game, the player will be tasked with a mission from an NPC character to collect an ancient gem hidden somewhere within a level. The player must then navigate dangerous obstacles in search of the gem, and then finally collect it before returning to the NPC, completing the game. To get started with creating the adventure, create a completely new and empty Unity project, and then import the particles, effects, characters, 2D, particle systems, and cross-platform input packages. You can import these from the Project Creation Wizard or from the Application menu via the Assets Import Packages option. Nice! We've successfully learned about a 2D adventure getting started. In the next one, we'll learn about importing assets.